You've been playing where you shouldn't be playing. Now someone else is getting all your best. These boots are made for walking. That's just what they'll do. One of these days, these boots are gonna walk all over you. I kept recording everything that I had with cello in it. I just thought it was so cool. It's the coolest sound to me. I just recently started putting it back into my shows and experimenting with looping and things like that. I'm, I'm a cello major, really. And that's, that's another reason why I was completely intimidated to find out that I was opening for Zoe Keating. Um, <laughs> because, I mean, I know you're not supposed to, to talk about this, but I'm definitely no Zoe Keating. <laughs> when I saw her come across on the Facebook page for the Kessler, I instantly was just like, I'm gonna be there. I'm, I'm so gonna be there. And then Jeff contacted me, Jeffrey Lyles, and said, well, I'm gonna work on getting you on the bill for that night. I don't know, listening to her music really inspires me to, to work harder on cello. There's, there's so much thought put into it. Getting to talk to her just now completely relaxed me. I was like, she's the sweetest, most down-to-earth person in the world. So. I would love someday to be able to help musicians like the way that other musicians have helped me. I feel like it's part of the cycle of music is that you know, if I, if I end up having any kind of success, I should be able to help other musicians get their audience too, you know. So I would like to be able to play that role for somebody like Tiger, but I don't think she needs me. She can do it by herself. She's really good. When you're playing an instrument that you love so much, you get really wrapped up in it and you feel really safe and comfortable in that. And uh, there was an interview that I watched with her and she was talking about how she just loves to be surrounded by that music, by this, this soundscape, I think she called it, when she's on stage and stuff, and, and I, I really admire that about her. I really like that we have that in common. It's that it's, it's really just this feeling of comfort when you're surrounded by that. We've been working like machines, don't know what the end means. We still see it in our dreams, it's still farther than it seems. We can see. Thank you. I'm Tiger Darrow. This is Alan Hayslip. Zoe Keating's next. Thank you so much.